Steve Horning from the uh, Legal Lanes in Nashville, New Hampshire. This is the U.S. Invitational. Paul Grant with Bob Lee on the call. We're grateful to have you with us. This is our third day of team matches. 17 teams competing for 10 playoff spots. A big match here. Uh, Price is wood flooring at 40 and 20s in the top four right now. Evan yep. Riva throwing first. On the right side. Prices. Crazy leaves on the oh left. Oh my God, I think he just got the one, two, three. We were just joking about that last night. Who's gotten the one, two, three? And well, Evan Riva does. Tim Douglas. Scott Douglas. Scott Douglas. Scott Douglas. The younger brother of Tim Douglas. Why Bull was on Tuesday nights at Union Lanes. This is for a spare. Won't go. So the third day of team matches. We'll be doing this tomorrow at 9 a.m. Playoffs start tomorrow, later in the day, and the finals will be on Saturday. 10 for Evan Reaver on the right for Price's Wood. Crazy leaves. Scott Douglas starts off with an eight. An early two-pin lead for Price's Wood flooring. Again, they're coming in at 40 and 20. Crazy leaves coming in at 29 and 31. Evan has a 118 league average from Stoneham, Massachusetts. He's on the head pin. He's got some wobbling there. Seven pin finally goes. Spare lead for him. Has the three and the six pin on the right. On the left, Scott Douglas from Marshfield, Mass. With a league average of 111. For the spare, he's on it. 20 after two for Evan Reaver for Price's Wood Flooring. First of two strings. Well, three more matches after this one. This is for a 10 somehow, he gets seven. So only 15 after two for Scott Douglas to start for Crazy Leaves. So right now it's a five pin lead and Price's Wood will be on a spare later on when Evan Reaver leads off again. Nate Lee's the captain of the team, usually bowls the anchor spot. He's bowling second here right now. Well, we have Josh Daly there to, for Price's. Yep. Josh certainly earned it with the single, his, his, comp, his uh, performance in the singles. Nate Lee's, Kingston, New Hampshire. Mike Nardone from North Grafton, league average of 108 on the left for Crazy Leaves. Spare lead for him, the one, two, and four. Nate Lee's for the spare, won't go. For a spare, punches out the head pin. A lot of excitement here, playoff atmosphere, stadium Patriots type atmosphere here, New England Patriots style. Nine blocks to start the string for Nate Lees. And an eight, making a nine for Mike Nardone. For Crazy Leaves, 29-24 early on for Price's Wood Flooring. They have one mark in hand. Nate Leaves, Nate Leaves on the uh, second box for a string, off to the right, punches out four. Mike Nardone goes left also, he gets four. Lee, second shot, good bid, gets four of the six. 6'10 six, standing. Mike Nardone gets the head pin, will go over, needs to go left. Won't go. Five pin, wanted to go left, stood up there. He was the five and the eight pin. Nate Lee's a pair of nines, 18 after two. Mike Nardone, good piece of wood here for a 10. He gets it, he's at 19 after two. So it's a four pin lead, 38-34 early on for Price's Wood Flooring. Again, coming in at 40 and 20, Crazy Leaves 29 and 31. Third bowlers of the string right now, Steve Latch, from my hometown, Salem, Massachusetts, the Witch City. 106, uh, 106 league average, it's a 116 league average, 116. It's off to the right. And for Crazy Leaves on the left, Mike Erickson out of Braintree, 114 league average on lane 35. He gets the half Worcester to start. 
Latch trying to pull this over for a spare. Good try, he gets it. What a shot. Four horsemen left, 10 pin on the right. Nails it for a spare in his first box. Erickson off the left. He's got five standing with one ball to go in his first box of the first of two strings here from Lita Lanes in Nashua. U.S. Invitational. He gets eight out of that for the box to start it off. This is like March Madness here. A lot of games all at once, a lot of action, boisterous crowd. The Super Bowl of Hamilton Bowling. Steve Latch working on a spare. In the second box of the first string. Gets five. Made that last time on the opposite side. 15 after one. Erickson on the head pin solid. Gets the 10 pin to fall. He's got the three on the left. The two, four, seven for a spare opportunity. Can Latch do it again? He does! Wow, two in a row, the four plus one. You don't see that too often back to back. Four Austin plus one, yeah, those 25. Are, those are just 20 percenters for a pro bowler. And you missing the four the plus a, Mike missed plus the left the post there. Or on the Cleary or on the post in the corner. Four horsemen right, four horsemen left, 25 plus two for Steve Latch. In nine blocks, 17 total for Mike Erickson for Crazy Lees. Right now it's 63 51, a 12 pin lead in the early going for Price's Wood Flooring. Fourth bowl is out of five coming up here. Mike McGinty on the right, 121 league average from Newmarket, New Hampshire. Left side is Tim Douglas, the older brother of Scott Douglas, 121 league average from Marshfield, Mass. Mike McGinty off the head pin, but he gets six. Tim Douglas. It's some action there. They keep falling. The 1 6 10 for a spare opportunity. And give these up the 7 8 pin. Crazy leaves the second match. They lost six earlier. All oh. six points. Two points for a win, one for a tie, two for total. Six points up for grabs. Nine for McGinty to start his first string. Tim Douglas for a 10, gets it. 72-61, 11 pin lead for Price's Wood Flooring. They also have two spares they're working on. Adonis McGinty. joined the fray. McGinty in his fourth, second box of the first string. That's the 4-7. Piece of wood angling the wrong way. It goes in the gutter. Gotta be careful that wood there. Mike Erickson has five on the first ball. This first spare, he gets it! 19 in a ball. Did use the wood. Spare bit, he gets it! What a shot there by Mike Erickson. Matching spares. 19 in the ball for McGinty. And uh, Tim Douglas. 20 in a ball after two. 82 71 early on. Prices went flooring up by 11. They're on three marks versus one for Crazy Leaf so far. Anchor bowl is coming up. Josh Daly, a 127 league average from Damers, Massachusetts. On the left, Chris Parkinson, 116 average out of Blackstone, Massachusetts. Lefty's first ball, the first string. Gets seven. Chris Parkinson on the left on 35. That's the four horsemen and the nine pin. Daly for a spare. Oh, he got it! What a shot that was! Wow! Spare in his first box. Parkinson tries to match it, won't go. Nice try by Chris. Two times. Two times the 10 pins held fast against, uh, against an assault from Crazy Leaves. Ten, 10 blocks for Chris Parkinson to start. Price is with flooring on four spares though. One coming up here for Josh Daly. 
in box number two of the first of two strings. Only one for Crazy Leaves. So momentum early on in favor of Prices with four and coming in at 40 and 20. Waiting for 36 to reset. Thank Bob Lee for all the uh, incredible time setting up the equipment here. Looks like we've got everything working now. Yep, audio's working better today. Multi-camera system. Live streaming nine o'clock every day through Saturday. Playoff start later tomorrow. Daily in the bonus. Second box, first string. He gets it to fall, two on the right. Nine in the fill, 19 after one. Chris off to the right a little bit. Has some good wood though. For a spare, missed it. Parkinson just missed it, but got all the fall, but the head pin. Daly for a 10. Easier the second time around, 29 after two though. Spare nine, 10, 29 after two. Chris with a pair of 10s, 20 after two. 111, 91, 20 pin lead after two boxes for Price's Wood Flooring. And they're working on three spares. Only one spare right now for Crazy Leaves. Scott Douglas for Crazy Leaves on the right. Had a 15 start after his first two. On the head pin, he gets the six pin to fall. He's got a 2-4. Evan Reaver on a spare. Strike on spare in the third box. Third, 30 after two. Missed the spare opportunity. Bryce Wood flooring on fire early on. 40 plus two bonus balls for Evan Riva. 10 box to Scott Douglas. 25 after three, slow start for him. Riva. On a strike on 35 in just a minute. First we Scott Douglas on the right for Crazy Leaves. Off to the left, gets some back door, gets seven, eight. Has the one and eight pin standing. Riva has a spare, now a strike. And what do you know? A half whister on the first. Did he get two on the strike though? And a lot of fills for the half whisters. It's for a 10. Eight, a spare rather, missed it. And on the strike field, he gets eight. Back to our 48 after three. Now this is for a 10. And got nine. 34 after four for Scott Douglas. And a nine for Evan Reaver. 57 after four. Price Wood flooring in control early. 148 so far. Crazy Leaves at 110, 38 pin lead. And for Crazy Leaves on the right side is Mike Nardone. Mike Nardone out of North Grap. Mike had 19 in his first two. Third box of the first string of two. Gets a couple to fall, he's got a 7-10 remaining. Nate Lees on the left, that is strike! His first mark, 28 plus two after three. <coughs> this is for a spare, oh. try to kick it over, good try. Mike Nardone going for a 10 box here. His third box, gets it. 29 after three, 158 to 120, 38 pin lead. Three marks to one advantage though for Pricewood flooring with the lead. Nate Lees will be coming up just a moment on a strike. Mike Mark now doing looking for his first mark. Solid hit. 
That's the six and nine pin. Nate Lee's on a strike, only two in the first ball. Now Joe looking for his first mark in the fourth box of the first string. Oh, punched out one. It looks easy, but it's really not. Lee, Nate Lee's first spare bit on the strike. It's nine. 19 bucks. 37 after three for Nate Lees. Lees is up to 47. And a captain got a nine for Mike Nardone. 10 for Nate Lees. Nardone at 38 after four. Lees at 47 after four. 177 to 129. 48 already. Wow. You're on fire. Two string match for our first string. Nita Lanes, Nash and Hampshire. U.S. Invitational, all great with Bob Lee. This is Mike Erickson from Braintree on 36 on the right, green shirt. Third box, first three. Off to left, gets a favorable six. Has the one, three, six, and the nine pin behind Steve Latch, Salem Mass. Steve. That's a fill of four, four in the spare, 29 after two. Mike punches one. Steve looking for three in a row, missed everything. Erickson for 10, gets nine. Nice out there. 38 after four. Sorry, 26 after three. 26 after three. And a seven box. 36 after three for Steve Latch. Erickson the right. Fourth box, first string. Nice hit there. Gets eight. Has the two and seven pin. Steve Latch, half Worcester left. Grazley needs some marks. Much needed spare there. Mike Erickson delivers. 36 in the ball up to four. Open box now for Steve Latch. Started off with two spares, spare five, spare four, a seven box, and now he's in the fourth box here. Third ball, gets eight for 44 after four. 196 to 148, it's a 48 pin lead for Price's Wood. They've got one spare to work on. Both these bowlers are on marks. Yep. Two marks for Crazy Leaves though. But both Tim Douglas and Mike McGinty yep. had spares. Yep. Tim Douglas coming up here on the right, on 36. 20 in the ball, coming in. Off the left, gets four, 24 after two. Mike McKinty on his spare, 19 to the ball, gets one, ouch. 20 after two, that's a lemon drop. Douglas trying to make this for a spare, almost. Left up the six pin. McGinty finds the hole. Only one down after two balls. Douglas for a 10. Missed it, gets a nine. 33 after three. Nice out there, he gets nine out of that. It's like, where was that in the first ball? 29 after three for Mike McGinty. 206 to 161, 45 now is the lead for Price's wood flooring. Tim Douglas, fourth box, first string on 36. Off to the left, gets some action, leaves up four, gets to four, leaves him six. McGinty on 35. Knocks down eight, back door. One and two pin for a spare leave. Douglas trying to pull off the spare. On the money, two full. He's up to three, six in the right, seven pin on the left. For a spare, he gets it. Mike McGinty, 39 of the ball up to four. 
Douglas gets two of the three. Nine box gives him 42 after four. 216 to 170. 46 is the lead. Each team working on one spare. Both Josh and Chris bowling in the anchor position were open in the second. Parkinson had two tens. Chris Parkinson had two tens for a 20 at the two. He's on the right hand, the green, the crazy leaves. Nice ball. Chance for a spare. Josh Daly opened up a spare nine in the 10 for a 29 after two. Box number three. Got some wood to help him. Parkinson misses it. Gets one of the two. Look to shoot for his third 10 in the row. Daly from Danvers Mass for a spare. Got the 10 to go, but the seven wouldn't. Chris, perfect, three tens, 30 after three. Josh Daly looking for a 10 here. Gets it. He's in 39 after three. 226 to 180, 46 pin lead still for Crazy Leaves. Chris Parkinson, fourth box, first strike, nice shot, three tens, and now he says finally. 40 plus two after four for Chris, nice shot. They needed that. Josh Daly, fourth box, first strike, he gets a strike. Matching strikes for Chris Parkinson and Josh Daly. 49 plus two for Daly after four. Lead is still 46, 236 to 190. Both teams have strikes and spares to work on. Back to the top of the order, boxes five and six. Exciting first string, a lot of action. Bryson Wood flowing back on the right side. The pin just broke off another alley, flew over to 36. Evan Reaver on the right side for Price's Wood. He's at 57 after his first four. He has two tens, a strike eight and a nine box. Scott Douglas on the left. Evans from Stoneham, Massachusetts, 118 league average. Scott Douglas for Crazy Leaves. Crazy Leaves will start on the left. He had a 34 for his first four. There'll be a delay as a pin broken. Slight delay here. Oh, we're back to action now. Evan Reba, box number five. Triangle in the corner. 6-10 on the right, nine pin behind. Scott Douglas has the one three six eight pin in the back. Reba for a spare. Mystic went to the right, got the 10 pin. Left up the six and the nine. Douglas for a spare, punched out the head pin. Brian Forney is coming for uh, Scott Douglas. Brian Forney, the captain of Crazy okay. Leaves, is bowling in the number one slot. Okay. Thanks, Bob. Did you like the information? Evan Reeve with a 10. Brian Fournier. Fournier or Fournier? Fournier. Fournier, okay. All right, so he hits nine box of 43 now for the combination of Scott Douglas and Brian Fournier. Crazily's trying to get back into this match. 47 pin lead right now for Price's Wood. Reaver, six box first strings off to the right, gets three. Brian Fournier, up the bench, a strike! 53 plus two up to six. Much needed strike for Crazy Leaves. Price Wood flooring in the lead. That's 35 once again. Backs up, no, there it goes. Yeah, we waiting for his uh, bowling balls to return on the rack. And we got Wood on 35 to clear.
This is the U.S. Invitational Live from Nashua, New Hampshire. Day three of team competition. 9 a.m. every day through Saturday doing the championship matches. Hey, Prices is showing how they, uh, how they jumped out to a 40 and 20 start after their first 10 matches. They're, uh, they're in the top four fighting for, that, uh, for one of the buys. The top two, will, two teams will have buys. Uh, Friday night, they will uh, they'll, they'll be excused while the uh, competitors in the third through tenth position battle it off, uh, bracket style, and they can get two rounds of buys and into Saturday morning. They can sleep in. We talked about the dummy team making the playoffs earlier. We were joking around about that. Can they win the title? And I was told earlier today that last year they actually came in third place. <laughs> but they didn't give them a playoff. Spot. Right. They want the prize. The dummy team wanted the prize money though. <laughs> That's funny. All right, Evan Reba. That was his second ball. Yep. The sixth. He's got the one and three on the right, four, seven on the left. Sixth box. Gets seven. 74 after six for Evan Reba from Stoner Nest. Okay, now the second ball is up. Nate Lee's on the right for Price's Wood. Mike Nardone for North Grafton Mass on the left. Nate Lee's is from Kingston, New Hampshire. On his fifth box. He got a strike in his third box. Had a nine fill on it, had 47 after four. Nardone coming in with 38 after four. Nate Lee's with five standing, hits it solid. Gets three of the five. Mike has the two, four, six, ten. Can he pick it up? What a try! Wouldn't go though. Nate will pick his favorite pin here. Missed both. Gets eight, 44 after four. Um, 55 rather, 55 after five for Nate Lees for Price's Wood. Now done with a 10, picks up one pin there, 48 after five, 261 to 219. Picked up two. Yeah. 42 pin lead right now. Both teams working on a spare and a strike later on. Nate Lees goes left, it's three. Solid shot by Nardone, set up for a spare. Two, four, seven on the left. Nate Lees goes for the three, gets two. This is for a spare, he gets it. Nice shot by Mike Nardone for Crazy Lees. 58 in the ball after six. Nate sweeps over, two, it's a nine box, 64 after six. 270 to 229, 41 pins is the lead for Price's Wood Flooring. Third bowl is Steve Latch on the right from Salem, Mass. Mike Erickson left from Braintree, Mass. Latch had a couple of marks to start. He's at 44 up to four coming in. He's on the money here, but he only gets six. Triangle in that right corner. 6, 10, and 9. 7 pin on the left. Mike Erickson on lane 35. First ball. 1, 7, 10. That's our, what, third one today? That's three of those today. You've seen. Mike was working on a spare, though. So 17, the, seven. yep, 17 in the box. 43 after 4. The lead is down to 34. Erickson. Oh, he gets the 1710. It's only twice we've seen that converted. The wood helped. Two spares in a row. 53 in a ball up to five. Steve Latch with an eight box. It's at 52 after five. Brings the lead down to 32. Trying to battle back. Play the wood in the gutter there. U.S. We, invitation. We just crossed the mid midpoint. Ball. And uh, 
the lead that was 52 is now up back to 31 for Prices. Latch on the head pin, two full. Three, six, ten on the right, four, Mike, seven on the left. Mike's ball is on the on the bonus, so they're gonna take six or seven off of that now, depending on what he does. Off to the right, but gets the four horsemen, six on the fill, 59 after five. 26 lead. Both teams on a spear and a strike still. Good try by Steve Bonko. Looking for three in a row here. On the head pin, but two full. Two, four, seven left up. Steve, third ball. Gets two for nine blocks, 61 after six. Three will be a gain. He gets two also. 68 with the nine box. 68 after six for Mike Erickson for Crazy Leaves. 287 to 261. 26 pins is the lead. Steve McGint, uh, Mike, Mike, McGint McGint Mike McGinney on a spare coming up. Tim Douglas in the left. Open box. On the spare. Goes to the right but gets seven. 46, 46 after four for McGinty. Doug punches, Tim Douglas punches through, gets five. Fifth box, first of two strings here. Lead Lane, Nash for New Hampshire, U.S. Invitational. Missed the head pin for the spare opportunity. Douglas trying to pull it over, only gets one. And he's got a mess here for it out. Advantage McGinty in this box. He gets 10. 56 after five. Tim on the out gets one of four, seven box. 49 after five. 304, 268. 36 pins again. Prices went up in front. They've been in control from the beginning. Crazy Lee's been a little bit of a comeback, but back up again. Here's the Caleri, McGinty. Tim Douglas on 35, head pin, but two full. Six box, first string. McGinty for spare, two full in the head pin. Chopped out one. Douglas trying to make this up. Good try. Five pin, wanted to go to the right, wouldn't go. Excellent try by Douglas. McGinty for a 10. Gets three, nine box, 65 after six. Nine for, for uh, Douglas, Tim Douglas. He is at 58 after six. So the lead remains at 36, 36 still. Yep. Price is wood up front. Both bowlers working on a strike here yep. in the anchor. Yep. Have you seen a triple strike this week yet? I've seen a bunch no, of doubles. I've heard, I, I've heard them down the lane, but not on 35 we, We've seen a few doubles here. One today, actually. Steve Reno Jr. had it. Daly on a strike, gets eight on the first ball. Parkinson on a strike, gets three in his first ball. Spare lead for Josh Daly. Has the four, two in the four pin on the left. For a spare, missed it. 18 in the box, 57 after four. Parkinson missed it. Ouch, three on the strike, 43 after four. Josh punches one for a nine box, 66 after five. Parkinson needs a big out, and does, gets a 10. Wish he had that in the second one, would have been a spare on strike, but easier in the third ball. 53 with that 10 after five for Chris. 330 to 290. 40 pin lead. 40 pins now. Daly, six box, first string. Gets a break. Parkinson, solid hit. Look at that lead. Wow. Josh has some really good wood there. Could help him out here. For the spare. Missed it. The two in the right went though. This is for a spare. 
Parkinson almost. Daly for a 10. Missed it. Nine pins, 75 after six. Chris going for a 10 here. Missed it. Nine blocks, 62 after six. Daly is furious with himself. Missing that shot. Still a 40 pin lead for Price's Wood flooring in the first of two strings here from Lee Delanes in Nashua, New Hampshire. U.S. Invitational. Teams competition. 9 a.m. tomorrow and Saturday as well. Five matches today. This is our second one. Top of the order. Brian Fournier punches out. Evan Reaver from Stoneham gets a split also. Brian is working on the strike, however. That's an eight pill. 18 in the box. They needed that. 61 he's at. 61 up to six now. Reaver to the left gets two. <clears throat> Brian looking for a nine or a 10 here. Gets the 10, nice shot. 71 after seven. Nine for Evan Riva, 83 after seven. 348 to 317, it's down to 31. And Crazy Leaves has a spare to work on. Next box up when Mike Nardone comes up. Brian Diamond. Evan Riva. Look at a strike and he gets it. Solid shot by Evan Reaver for a strike in the eighth box. He's at 93 plus two. And what a spare for Brian Fournier coming back. 81 and a ball after eight. Nice shot by Brian Fournier. 358 to 327. 31 pin lead for Price's Wood. A lot of marks here in the first string. A lot of excitement here from Lita Lanes in Nashua. U.S. Invitational. Mike Nardone on a spare here on 36. Head pin punches five. 15 fields and 63 after six. Nate Lees on the left on 35. Head pin, but gets six. Two and two. Nardone gets two of the three on the side. Four seven, nothing going there. Six ten on the right. Both looking for a good out here. Mike Nardone of Crazy Leaves gets nine. He's at 72 after seven. Nate gets eight. He is at 72 after seven. The lead is 35 right now. Is it, is it 25 or 35? 25. 25. 25. 366 to 341. In favor of Price's Wood Flooring. Now Mike, Doan. Mike grabs five, right. more, five of those back on his uh, spare fill back here. Nate Lee, solid hit, but gets the 7-10. And not a really good situation with the wood. Now Doan sweeps three on the left. This could be the shot of the day. Nate Lee's, if we can get this one. Hits the wood, won't go over though. Open boxes for both bowlers. Mike Dardone looking for the triangle here for a 10. Missed it wide right. Seven box, 79 after eight. Nate Lees with a nine, gains two. 81 after eight. 375 to 348, 27 is, 27 is the lead for Price's Wood Flooring. A lot of enthusiasm here in Lita Lanes, Nashua. U.S. Invitational. Paul Grant along with Bob Lee. Thank you for joining us. Hope you're enjoying the match as much as we are. We got three more matches to go after this. Four on Tuesday, five yesterday on Wednesday, and 
Second and five today. Mike Erickson. He's open. Just missed a head pin. Has the Caleri, maybe, but nope. One fell down. So he's got the one, the eight, the six, and the ten. Steve Latch off to the right. Four drop. Mike Erickson looking for the spare. He's got some wood to help him. Got to hit it just right. Off the head pin, gets the three of the four. The ball went right around it, almost got it. And Steve Latch on 35 has the wiggle and just missed his spare. Two great tries. Erickson looking for a 10 box here on 36. Missed it, nine box. 77 after seven. Nine for Steve Latch. 70 even after seven. 389 to 357. 384 to 357. 27 still the lead for Price's Wood Flooring. They got one strike coming up. One spare coming up for Crazy Leaves. Erickson in eighth box of the first string of two. Off to the right, chops out the lemon drop. Six pin. Meanwhile, on 35, Steve Latch gets eight. Chance for a spare here. Wood's a little tricky once at the left side of the front of that wood. It might. Might miss the five pin. Erickson on the head pin. Good comeback. Go, oh, get the other one to fall. Leaves up one. Four pin standing. Steve Latch, the Salem Mass man. For a spare. He gets it. 80 and a ball after eight to Steve Latch. Looks like the wood in the back. Wood in the back came into play there and took out the five. Erickson for 10 gets it. 87 after eight for Mike Erickson for Crazy Leaves. 394 to 367, still 27. Mark advantage goes to Price's Wood. They have a spare and a strike. Crazy Leaves only working on a spare. Fourth ball is here coming up. Tim Douglas and Mike McGinty. Tim Douglas on the right. Open. Yep. And they were both open in the sixth. Tim has 58 coming in after six. First ball, first string of the box, seven. Cleary. And that's a strike by Mike McGinty. What a shot that was. 75 plus two after seven. This is for a spare head pin. Two full. Look good. Let it go. Douglas going for a 10 here. Nice ball, 10 box. They'll clear the wood in the gutter there. 35. So Bob, how long did it take you to set up the equipment here? I gave myself 45 minutes. Uh, we had to try out a few different microphone combinations. Uh, spent about a half hour uh, setting up the land cords so that we wouldn't have to rely on Wi-Fi uh, on the first night. We came down Sunday night for that. Douglas so at 10 box at 68 after 7. Box number 8 of the first of two strings. Second match of 5. Off the head pin but gets 6. McGinty on a strike on 35. Look at the 2. 8. The wood, I don't know if that's going to help him or not. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Nothing doing. That's the fourth pin on the left, 10 pin on the right. Tim Douglas going for a spare. What a shot. The wood blocked it out. Wood cost him that time. Second ball on the fill. Oh, what a try. Almost got the 10. Not quite. Super shot, nine on the strike fill, 84 after seven. 
Leads up to 36 at the moment. Tim Douglas, that was a out that of the gutter. Nine. Nine, drop, nine box at 77 after eight. And nine from McGinty, 93 after eight. Prices with flooring in control, all string. 422 to 386. 36 pins is the lead. And a spare coming up here soon. Open boxes right now, though. Chris Parkinson on the right for Crazy Leaves. Had a strike earlier. Is it 62 up to 6 coming in? Josh Daly coming in with 75 after 6 in his seventh box. Parkinson for a spare. Will it roll over? It does! What a shot by Chris Parkinson for the spare. Got the wood to roll over and the ball helped out. Daly for a spare. What a try! Not quite. Still dancing. Parkinson 72 in a ball after seven. Ten box for Josh, 85 after seven. Coming up the 127 league average. Parkinson, a thrilling spare shot. 72 in a ball here after seven. On the fill, head pin! Gets seven. 79 after seven for Chris. So we can twirl that wood over to the left. Josh Daly, head pin, solid hit, spare leave, 4-7. Parkinson for a spare bid, nudged it. Josh Daly on 35. Looking for his first mark in a while. Gets it, 95 and a ball after eight. Parkinson with an eight. A lot of excitement here, Bob. Definitely not dull. Matt Susie just uh, almost knocked over PDP Crawford with a high 10. <laughs> 87 after eight for Chris Parkinson. 440, 442 to 411. 31 pin lead right now for Price's Wood. We'll go to the final two boxes of the first of two strings here from Lita Lanes in Nashua at the US Invitational. <clears throat> Evan Reaver on the right for Price's Wood. He's on a strike here. Nine in the first one. Ryan Forney on a spare. Eight, Phil. It's 89 after eight for him. Reva looking for a spare on strike. Can he pick it up? No, out of the gutter. So it'll be a 111 now after nine. For Evan. Forney had missed the spare. A 10 would give him 99 after 9. 99 after 9. 460 to 429. 31 pin lead for Price's Wood. Reaver's 10th and final box of the first string of two. Three. Pony looking for another mark here. Off the head pin, but gets six. That's the one, three, six on the seven pin on the left corner. Reaver looking for a spare here. Solid hit. He's up two. Nine pin on the back. Two pin on the left. Nice try by Brian. Not enough on it. Josh with a nine to finish up with a 120 first string. Bubba's league average of 118. Monier with a nine box. He has a 108 for the string. 469 to 428. 
438 rather, 31 pin lead. The price is wood. Open box is coming up here. Nate Lees on 36. Nice hit, triangle. Five, eight, and nine pin. Mike Dardone waiting for 35, again stuck again. He's at 79 coming in after eight. Price is what has been on fire since the beginning. They still have two spares to work on in the final two boxes, none for Crazy Leaf, so they can distance themselves pretty good here in the first string. Two strings at, on hand here, coming up. Two points, rather, for each string. Two for the total. And waiting for 35 to get fixed again. You're watching the U.S. Invitational from Lita Lanes in Nashville, New Hampshire. This is Paul Grant along with Bob Lees. Thrilled to have you with us. Day three of our team competition. We do it again tomorrow, 9 a.m. and Saturday, 9 a.m. This is our second of five matches today. Playoffs start later tomorrow. Finals on Saturday. Nate Lees looking for a spare. <coughs> In his ninth box. Mike Nardone waiting for 35 to start, trying to get a mark in his ninth box. Bob gets a well-deserved coffee break. Thanks, Paul. It's an enormous break to be able to walk away for, for 10 seconds like that. No. <laughs> It's been hard getting to sleep at night because the adrenaline is pumping. It's hard to get it. It's so wound up. It's so exciting. 12-hour days, 13-hour days, and yeah, well, it's, it, it's, it's, the adrenaline is so great. You just want to do the guys justice. They're, 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 the, they're the top bowlers. We see, we'll see them at, uh, you know, at Pro Series events and at uh, Outrun the Bears and different places like that. But it, just to see them all together in the same place. Yeah. Meeting at the highest level like this. We, we do miss Canada though. This is the Super Bowl of uh, Candlepin Bowling, and Candlepin is real bowling. None of that 10 pin stuff here. Wing 35 is back. This Christmas season, think uh, gift cards for Candlepin bowling, bowling. Check your local Candlepin Bowling alleys. Candlepin Bowling gift cards for Christmas. Full hit for uh, Mike Nardone. He's got the three and one remaining. Nay Lee's first spare gets it. 91 on the ball after nine. Now Dolan goes down the hole on the second shot. Eight bucks, 87 after nine. Price is wood in total control here in the first string. 479 to 446. 33 is the lead, and they're working on three marks, and none for Crazy Leaves. Nate Leaves typically bowls in the anchor spot. Ball number two spot this time. Well, he's the captain. I, I, I don't think anyone's arguing with Josh Daly being Not at anchor. all. It's five in the fill. Half whistle left for Nardone. Nate Leaves up to 96 after nine. <clears throat> Hits three of the five at 104 currently in the string. 106 the best he can do. Now Doan trying to come back after the half Worcester. Leaves four. At 10 for Nate Lees, a 106 first string. Mike Nardone finishing up with the seven box, 94 after one. Price is wood in the lead. They got a good start, did not take their foot off the gas. Steve Latch, the third bowler. Price is wood on the right. 
Mike Erickson on the left with crazy leaves. He's on a spare. Gets the four horsemen. Kamrowski special. Six fill, 86 after eight. Erickson open box on 35. Off to the right, gets six. Has the one, two, four, and the nine. For a spare bid, gets two. Mike Erickson, uh, Mike Erickson, 114 league average from, Brain, from Braintree. Hit the object pin, but head pin only got one. Latch going for a 10, right on. 96 out to nine. <clears throat> Erickson gets eight. 95 after nine. 510 to 461. 49 pin lead for Price's Wood. Steve Latch, 10 blocks for the first string. We have one more to go after this. And then three more matches following. Erickson trying to get the total down. Oh. Paid the price for hitting head pin. Spread eagle. Latch has a chance for a spare here. Hits it right, but it won't go. Yeah, will. Oh, come on. Ball is right by. Hit the wood, still wouldn't go. Three times. Got three of the six. A 10 would give him a 106. And he does. He matches Nate Lee's 106 for Price's Wood. Evan Reaver at a 120. Nate Lee's Steve Latch 106 for Price's Wood. And a nice 10 after a spread eagle. 105 for Mike Erickson for Crazy Leaves. 520 to 471. 49 is the lead. Price's Wood in control. So they'll get two points here. They'll bring them to 42 and 20. Crazy Leaves will drop to 29 and 33. Four more points up for grabs. Two for the second string, two for total. One should there be a tie. Mike McGinty, fourth bowler, on the right. Nice drop, gets nine. And there's a solid shot, will it go? It's nine. Tim Douglas from Marshfield for Crazy Leaves. Open box has four bowlers. He's his first spare. He got it. Mike McGinty, 103 after nine plus a ball. And no luck on that spare bid for Tim Douglas. Wood caromed around. Ten box from Douglas, 87 after nine. Price and Wood will add to their lead. They've got two marks to work on, one here. For Mike McGinty from Newmarket, New Hampshire, league average of 121. <clears throat> on a spare, going to the 10th box. Missed the head pin, but got seven, 136 standing. Half Worcester left for Douglas. McGinty's up to 110 after nine. <laughs> Looking for a spare, missed it to the right. A 10 will give him 120. Ginty, uh, Douglas comes back, it's nine. One ball to go. Missed it, nine box, 119 for Mike McGinty. Douglas looking for a 10 for Crazy Leaves. 10 would give 97 for the string. Won't go, 96 for Tim Douglas. 546 to 490. Lead has increased. 56 for Price's Wood. Final two boxes, first string, team captains. Josh Daly of Danvers, Mass. Ankerman here. Brian, Brian Forty is the captain. Crazy Leaves and I, say, Lee. I said captain. I meant to say Ankerman. 
as the Kamarowski special for what's been left. Parkinson has the half Worcester right, seven pin on the left. The spare, almost. The wood's out of play unless it rolls back. Parkinson going for a spare, gets one of the three. Josh Tilly, league average of 127. It's nine, he's at 110 after nine. Chris gets an eight, 95 after nine. 561, 498 is it? It's 63 pin lead, if I see it right. Sense. Daly half was to right. Chris Parkinson trying to get close to the total. Leads up four. Has the one, two, four, and the eight pin in the back. Josh Daly trying to make something out of this. Gets to spare after half Worcester. What a shot. 120 in a ball, and there's a spare to match him. Chris Parkinson. He's at 105 in a ball. Five seventy-one to five oh eight, sixty-three pin lead. Both on a spare to close out the first of two strings here from Nashua at Lita Lanes. Oh! On a spare, gets six, one twenty-six for Josh Daly for Price's Wood. Chris Parkinson with a five fill, one ten for Crazy Leaves. Final score on the first string, five seventy-seven for Price's Wood. 513 for Crazy Leaves. That is a 64 pin victory. And we'll get ready for the second string in just a moment. Paul Grant with Bob Lee live streaming from Lee Delanes in Nashville, New Hampshire. This is the U.S. Invitational, the Super Bowl, the World Series, all in one. 17 teams competing for 10 playoff spots. And the winning, winning team will split $8,000 on Saturday. Brian Fournier will lead it off, or is he coming out? Yep. Brian's checking in, I believe. Yes. Maybe some lineup changes here. Yeah, we'll try to get those for you in a sec. Sometimes we don't. They don't tell us. We need to keep, lose track. Brian Fournier stays in. Lineups are staying in. Evan Reaver on the left for Price's Wood. And three drive, he gets stuck there in the alley. Reva has a half Worcester in the seven pin. The two, the eight, and the seven pin standing. For a spare bid, missed the head pin, leaves the triangle. For a spare, got the half Worcester with a seven wooden budge. Missed it, seven box for Brian Fournier. And a nine for Evan Riva, two pin lead, first box of the second string. Price of wood flooring are 66 in the match. You have to win in the first by 64. Top bowler was Josh Daly with a 126. Head pin hit, gets seven. Has the four pin on the left, six ten on the right. Here's Evan Riva, second box, second string. Has the one, two, four, and the nine pin in the back. Top bowler was 110, Chris Parkinson. The crazy leaves. Trying to get that wood to roll over, won't go. Josh misses the head pin. Open boxes for both bowlers, first two boxes. For a 10, he gets it. And a 10 also for Evan Riva. 19 after two for Evan. 17 for Brian after two. Two pin lead for Price's Wood Flooring. 
we may have a lineup change here for Crazy Leaves. Lineup change? Okay, no changes. They're staying with their starting five. Mike, Mike Nardone needed a lung snap. I don't miss the days when they smoked in the bowling alleys. I bowled in the league in Somerville one time, and um, by the third string, I was just like, ugh. Hey, Mike, Mardon, Mike Nardone on uh, 36 and has a 5 7 10 split for his first ball to second string. Nate leaves half Worcester left on 35. Nate had a 106 for his string. Mike Nardone came in with 94 in his first. 5 7 10 with a piece of wood. Can you get it? Do it in the gutter. Minus one. Nate leaves. Gets five out of those seven, out of those eight, rather. Has the three pin on the right, four, seven on the left. Five and ten pickup here, nothing going. That'll be a seven after that gutter ball knocked one down for Mike Gardone. Seven after one. Nate Lees with an eight after one. Three pin lead, 27-24 early on. The price of wood flooring. Up 67 in the match. 67 in the match. Mike Dardone try to get something going here. Off, but gets a good seven drop. Nice piece of wood. Three, six, ten on the right. Nate Lees gets nine drop. He's up to six pin for a spare leave. Both have great chances here for a mark. Nardone for the spare. He gets it. 17 out to two and a ball from Mike Nardone for crazy leaves. Nate Lees. Right at the pin, who needs wood? 18 in the ball at the two for Nate Lees. 37 to 34, three pin lead. Price of wood flooring, 67 up in the match. Third bowl is here. Mike Erickson on the right for Crazy Leaves. On the left for Price's wood flooring is Steve Latch. Steve had a 106, Mike had a 105. Got to clear that wood out of the gutter. Exciting match though. A lot of action, even though it was a 64 point win, it was a lot of action, both sides. Back door, knocks down six. Off to the left, Latch gets three. Their first box here in the second string of two. This first spare, missed the head pin though. Latch goes off to the right, leads up four, has the one and three, four on the seven. Mike Erickson, head pin for a 10, missed it. Starts up with a nine. Steve Latch, third ball here. First box in the second string. Punches out the head pin, a seven box. One pin lead right now, 44-43 for Price's Wood early in the second. 65 is their lead in the match. Mike looking for a mark here in the second box, the second string. Off to the left though, gets four. Steve Latch, second box. Knocks down seven, back door. Has the one, the three, and the ten pin. Mike Erickson has six pins standing here. Off the head pin, get some action, three standing. His first spare, he gets it off the wall. Steve Latch delivers a spare to second box, 17 up and plus a ball at the two. Eight box for Mike Erickson, he's at 17 after two. 54, 51, three pin lead now for Price with flooring. 67 in the match. Excuse me, Price is Wood on two marks, two spares. Crazy Leaves on one spare later on. Uh, 
Mike McGinty and Tim Douglas here now. No, no, that's, a change. that's Mike Erickson. I'm sorry, Mike Erickson. And Mike McGinty. Oh, they moved him around. I didn't get told that change. Just look at the hole, at the bowlers. McGinty's got a W back there. Sorry, that was, that was Erickson with the W back there. He's third now for them. I got it wrong. And McGinty has a spare lead on 35. This is the 4, 5, 7, 8, 9. Wood over the 4. For Erickson. Punched out the middle one. McGinty for a spare. He gets it. 10 in the ball up to 1 for McGinty. Who's the third bowler? And he sweeps it over, nice 10. 10 after one for Mike Erickson. Lineup change, we weren't told about. Mike has gone from the third to the fourth slot. Second box, second string here for Mike Erickson. Solid hit and head pin. What's it though? McGinty on a spare. Nine drop leaves up the 10 pin. 19 after one. Tim Douglas switched spots yeah. with Mike Erickson. Didn't, didn't catch that. What do you call it? I, I, I thought it was Tim Douglas. Ten box, two tens, 20. That's a 20 nine. for Mike Erickson. Nine for Mike McGinty. 28 after two. 82 71, 11 pin lead. Ankubola is coming up here. Chris Parkinson for Crazy Leaves on the right. Josh Daly on the left for Price's Wood. With an 11 pin lead. 75 in the match. Both off the head pin. Second ball. First box, second string, nice shot, head pin. Gets five of the six, good try. Drop the Kaliri, but not the post. Head pin and he gets a spare, what a shot. Four horsemen plus one. Spare for Josh Daly, opening up the second string. 10 for Chris Parker, 10 after one. Not 11 pin lead, they'll be adding to that here in just a moment. They're working on three spares, one coming up here for Josh Daly. Only one on the left. Only one for Crazy Leaves to work on. Mike, Mike Nardone. Nardone, he's the second yeah, he's bowler. On the weak eagle Chris, nine drop, Little go for a strike. Not quite. On the fill. Missed the head pin, got eight. 18 up to one. Parkinson for a spare, gets it. 20 and a ball off the two for Chris Parkinson. For another spare, off to the right. Missed the head pin, got a, a generous eight, and then missed it totally on the second shot. Trying to find the head pin here for a 10. Now he gets it, 28 after two. Not happy with himself. Yeah, that would have been a four horseman lead for a mere mortal, but his, his uh, the pins do different things yeah. after they get hit that fast. He has high standards, upset with himself. 
Every bowler wants a spear or a strike. You're never satisfied as a bowler, are you? 110, 91, 19 pin lead early on. The price is wood. Both teams on two spares, though. Here's Evan Riva. He was open, but... Uh, nine, fill, nine drop, rather. Set perfectly for a spare. Ryan Fournier with a 17 start for his first two on box number three. Clips three. Riva for a spare. Has it. 29 of the ball after three. Fournier, good comeback here. Let go. 10 pin. Won't budge. And he gets a 10 box. 27 after three. A seven and two tens for Brian Fournier. You have Reaver, 29 on the ball after three. 19 pin lead right now for Price's Wood. They're up to three marks they're working on now, two for Crazy Leaves. Reaver, Reaver working on the mark here on 36. On the head pin, but doesn't get much, but it's rolling around. And look at this one. How often you see this one? A seven, eight, nine, ten leave. Nice. With some wood, six fill. Oh, well, that's a picket fence. That's what they call it? Yep. yep. That's right. Forgot about that one. Find eight drop, seven, ten, piece of wood. 35 after three now for Evan Reaver after that spare six for the third. For a spare! Will it go? He got three of the four. Gave it a ride, wouldn't quite go. On here for a spare. Guttered it. Viva for a 10. Has it. 45 after four. Brian looking for a 10 here somehow. Gets nine. I'll put him at 36 after four. 136 to 110. 26 is the lead in the string. 90 in the match. For Price to win flooring. Both teams on marks. Here's one right now for Nate Lees on a spare. Gets nine. 27 after two. Now down a good bid for a strike. Four pin, was trying to go left, wouldn't go. He's got the four seven spare lead. Coming in at 25. One pin got, pick up he, on that exchange. He got eight in his spare, 25 after two. Another spare for Nate Lee. Nate Lee's 37 and a ball after three. Looking for a second in the row. Oh, Missed no. it, up one. Could have used that one. Tank is in 35 after three. Mike Nardone just missed that opportunity for a spare to try to regroup here in box number four of the second and final string of this second match of five during the day. Nate Lees on the fill has the Kamrowski special. Four horsemen. Rick Kamrowski of uh, Framingham. Semi Pro League made a living off that shot in his heyday. 43 up to three for Nate Lees, but missed the head pin. Chance for Mike Nardone here. That's the two and the seven. Can he pick it up? He does! Nice shot. 45 and a ball up to four for Mike Nardone for Crazy Lees. Nate Lees with a 10. 53 up to four. 171 to 138. 33 pin lead right now for Price's Wood. They're on one spare, two spares for Crazy Leaves coming up. Steve Latch with the spare here to work on. Third bowler out of five for Price's Wood on the spare. 17 plus, 10 strike on spare. 27 after two, 37 plus two bonus balls after three.
Tim Douglas on the left has an ugly leave here. Missed it totally. That puts the lead up to 48. One, seven, eight, six, and 10 on the right. It's just for a, somehow a 10. Chopped out the head pin, tough six. 47, 23 after three. And he takes himself out of the lineup. And Dennis Green is going to be going in. Dennis Green, the veteran, pulls out of Millis, the semi pro league, Atlantic Candlepin singles tournament. Explosive bowler. Used to bowl in the Friday Night Mixed League with Rick Kamarowski and myself. Yeah, all like crazy leaves is all from uh, south of Boston. Uh, yeah. Even Brian Fournier who lives up here, uh, works, at, works at Ryan's and Mills. I knew I recognized him from something. All right, Steve Latch. Got a strike on a spare. He's on a strike. Phil here on 36. Looking for two in a row. Six. Decent wood there. Dennis Green filling in. Gets four on the left. Coming off the bench. Tim Douglas. Tim Douglas had 96 in the first string. He's pulled himself out. Yeah, now it's Dennis Green. Yeah. Almost got the spare. Dennis Green has the one and the nine pin. Going for a 10 box in a minute. The ball in the gutter there, they have to clear out. Yeah, you don't want to hit that. Even though the wood's there to protect it. You have to remove the ball by league rules. Scotty Douglas will take care of it. Price is what dominating the match. Won the first by 64 in control here in the second. Latch going for a 10 box, just missed a spare. 10 box, 56 after four. Solid start. Eight for Dennis Green off the bench. 31 after four between him and Tim Douglas. Leads up to 58. 122 in the match. So Price Wood pretty much guaranteed four points. Pretty much four points. Yeah, they're, they're, they're fighting for one of those buys. They, they, I was just talking to Tim Matero, um, and, and uh, we, we believe that the, the, any of the top two teams get two rounds of buys and will automatically be in the semifinals. Teams number three through eight will battle it out for uh, basically th those eight teams will three versus ten and four versus nine and so forth. Yeah. And then they'll play they'll play two rounds. Two of those teams will emerge and you'll have uh, McGinty, four, in, four in the semifinals. McGinty got nine drop on his first ball. Mike Erickson hooked three on the right. For a spare, he's on it. 38 in the ball. After three from McGinty. This is for a spare. What a comeback in that shot. Mike Erickson delivers for Crazy Leaves. He had two tens, now a spare. 30 in a ball. After three. 220 to 162, though. 58 pin lead. Both on spares here. Going into the fourth box of the second and final string of this match. McKinty gets nine. 47 after three. He's got two spare nine fills. Nine box sandwiched in between. Erickson on a spare. Half Worcester. We've seen a ton of half Worcester spare fills this week. Too bad. Tough break. 32 after three. McGinty for his third spare on four boxes, delivers 57 and a ball up to four. What a start for Mike McGinty.
for Price's wood flooring. Teammates are holding a towel over Nate Lees, prevented from looking at Mike McGinty. They believe that he does better when Lees is not watching. <laughs> Why don't they just booed him off the island? <laughs> I did it, Mama! I did it! Why is he on their team then? <laughs> tell, tell me about the towel, Mike. Uh, one seven ten is. Oh, I'm one seven ten there. there. Two of the nine box. Forty one after four for Mike Erickson. Two thirty nine to one seventy three domination by Pricewood Flooring in control for six points. Josh Taylor, the anchor on the right for Price's Wood. Chris Parkinson on the left. Parkinson's on a spare. On a spare. Gailey had a spare eight and a 10, 28 to two. McGinty on a spare on 35. Chuffs the lemon drop, one. That's Parkinson. Parkinson, 21 after two. Gailey trying to pull this off, gets only one. Parkinson comes back in the second shot, gets seven on that one. For a 10 box somehow. Gets eight. 36 after three. Parkinson with a 10. 31 after three. 247. 184. Prices with flooring in control. 63 pin lead in the string. 127 in the match. Fourth box, second string. Josh Jaley gets three. Open boxes for both bowlers. Chris Parkinson on 35. Nice hit for a strike. He gets it. 41 plus two balls for Chris Parkinson. Trying to make up with that spare one, Phil. In the hole for Daly. Seven standing, needs a big out here. That'll be a big swing if he puts in the same spot. But on the head, Pink gets 10. <laughs> he didn't want to do. He didn't want to do that. What a 10 out of that mess. 46 after four for Josh Daly. 257 to 194. 63 pin lead in the string. Price with flooring. 127 in the match is the lead. Back to the top of the order. Fifth and six boxes. Bryant Fournier on the right. 36 after four coming in here. He has the Kamrowski special four horseman left side. Evan Riva head pin gets six. Triangle in the corner. Plus the 10 pin. He had 45 in his first four. Missed it. Sweep it over, not quite. You said it's a 40% chance in the four horsemen? That's what the data says. I think it, you should have studied Rick Kimbrowski. I think he hit it 80% of the time back then. I don't believe it. <laughs> I, I bowl with him twice a week. Well, he's, he hasn't done as much lately. And that's why you joke about it. He came out special. He doesn't make it anymore now. I think we can put, file that one away. <laughs> semi-pro bowlers at the moment. Yeah. All right. Brian has a uh, 43 now after that seven box after five. Evan Riva after the eight has 53 after five. One, three, six, and seven on the left pin. I hear a lot of guys say that pe people make 95% of their single pinners. And it just doesn't happen. Yeah. <laughs> it's uh, sometimes 78, sometimes 80, never. Over, over the long term, those, those numbers come back to earth. Maybe with a piece of wood, it's 95%. That's why we, that's why we keep track of the data, though. You're, yeah. you'll, remember, you'll remember something that's remarkable, and you won't, and you won't remember all the other times. And uh, it's very difficult to do math in your head. When you're when you're just watching uh, watching people on lead night, 
you got to keep it down, right? Put, put the numbers in a, in a, in a database and uh, really look at a lot of at a big sample. That's, that's sort of like a baseball average. I, I, hear, I hear guys say, oh, yeah, you always get to hit. No, <laughs> the best hitter in baseball ever, you know, in the modern era, was batted 406. That was a long time ago, Ted Williams. The 300, you fail 70% of the time and you're in the Hall of Fame. Mortier. Nice try. Evan Riva for a spare. Can he kick it over? Won't quite get there. Third ball for Ryan gets the field goal. Eight box. 51 after six. It's for a 10 for Evan. That gives him 63 after six. 275 to 203 or nine. 203. 66 pin lead. Prices wood flooring. Up by 130 in the match. Nate Lee's coming up. He had 53 after four. Solid start. Mike Nardon coming up on a mark. As we start the fifth box of the second string. Nate gets three more to drop. On the spare for Nardon. He gets six. Nate leaves a spare. 63 in a ball. I think that's a scoreboard error on that. Till he gets six, it's showing nine. It's over there. 19. 19 in the fourth. Okay, there he is. Okay, sorry. Nate leads us 61 after five. You have to have other spare now. 64 in a ball. Leads down to 55. For Nardone. Looking for another one. Triangle, seven fill though. 71. 48, just like that. The, correct, the score was corrected on that. That's why I got mixed up on that one. Looking for another one. Gets it, nice shot by Nardone. Three in a row. 81 at the six, plus the ball from Mike Nardone for Crazy Leaves. <coughs> Five, seven, 10 special, he gets eight. 69 at the six for eight leaves. Just like that, it's down to 46. That's a 20 pin swing for uh, Crazy Leaves. Two more of those and we got a, we got a game. We're, we're only at the midpoint here. Mike Eric's on the right for Crazy Leaves. Get some action in the back, six drop. Dennis Green. Dennis, oh, Dennis Green, I'm sorry. He's filled in, that's right. The wrong name. Dennis Green, the sixth drop. Going for a spare here. Looks good. He gets it. Dennis Green delivers. 41 in the ball up to five. Steve Latch, right side action, leaving up three. For a 10, gets nine. 65 after five for Steve Latch from Salem, Massachusetts, my hometown. Dennis Green on 36, working on a spare. Trying to bring Crazy Leaves to at least two points, two points here in the string. On the head pin, only got five though. to 40 now. 46 after five. Punches out. Five standing for Latch.
Dennis giving some advice how to play the shot. This is for a spare. Looks good, but didn't get over the left far enough. That was the ball we wanted. Got the triangle up there. Four, seven, and eight pin is standing. Steve Latch has a bunch to work with here. Nice ball! Oh, he got it! What a shot that was! Wow! 75 and a ball up to six for Steve Latch. Dennis Green with a 10. 56 after six. 310 to 270. 40 pins is the lead in the string for Price's Wood. 114 in the match. Mike McGinty's got a spare in the fourth. He's, he's in a bonus. Mike Erickson bowling first on lane 36 for Crazy Leaves. He had 41 after his first four with one mark. On lane 36, back door, and he's up five. Yeah. On a spare, McGinty, oh, it's a strike, not quite. Looked good there, nine drop, what out of play. 19 in the box, gives him 66 after four. Those nine go right back on top of the lead though, which is up to 49. You're watching the U.S. Invitational here from Lita Lanes in Nashville, New Hampshire. Paul Grant along with Bob Lee. It's been all Price's Wood flooring. Both strings. The one the first by 64. Tim Matero are fetching the pin. They're up 40 at this string so far. He's on the bench. He just, he, just, uh, he was bowling anchor a few minutes ago uh, for, for Price's. He won, they won their match by one pin on his final shot. He got a single on the seven. That was Tim Matero. Erickson tries to sweep it, misses it to the left, gets one. Seven bucks. He's trying to get a spare, three in a row. Missed it in the gutter. That's a foul. 75 after five. 75, not halfway to a 150 at that pace. He's, been He's had a couple struggles with, this, with the seven pin. That's why they were putting the towel up earlier. 328 for Price's Wood, 277. Crazy leaves. 51 pin lead in the second. Anchor bowl is here now. Not yet, sorry. Coming up next, still Erickson, still Erickson and McGinty. Another 1710, that's four today we've seen now. You say two out of the 12 have gone? Yeah, two, two of the 14, two of the uh, 16 have gone. Sweeps and gets it! No, no one's got it without wood, though, in fairness. Nice spare there for Mike Erickson. 58 in the ball up to six. Nine drop. He missed the last one for his spare. Speaking cash on this one. Towel's not up on this one. Ten box. 85 after eight. At the six, 85 at the six. Now the anchor bowlers are up. Chris Parkinson on the right for Crazy Leaves. Josh Daly on the left for Price's Wood Flooring. <laughs> Daly working on a strike. I'm sorry, no, that's uh, Parkinson with the strike. Yeah. Five, He's four in the, in the first one. Here is a strike! Now Daly's working on this. Right on cue, Bob. 56 plus two after five for Josh Daly. From Danvers, Mass. Hawkinson. 
Picks up two there. That's seven in the strike, Phil. Nine in the box, 57 now after five for Chris. 348 to 303, it's 45 right now. Come down a little bit. It's about to go up again. Yep. Daly working a strike here. Gets eight. 6-10 pin standing. Parkinson to try. There it is. Spare on strike. 76 in the ball up to six for Josh Daly. Parkinson with a seven. Now it's 64 up to six. 368 to 310. 58 pin lead for Price's Wood. Won the first by 64. Moving to the seventh and eighth boxes now. Yeah. Playoff atmosphere here at Lita Lanes in Nashua at the U.S. Invitational. Ryan Forney on the left. On the right is Evan Reaver leading off here. Head pin. Leaves one on the side, left side. Three, six, ten on the right. Four pin on the left. Fournier hooks only the lemon. Oh, he got two there, actually. Open boxes, both these bowlers. Try to kick it over, not quite, got one. Fournier trying to bounce back. Gets eight, and seven of that shot, moving up one. And Reaver gets an eight box. 71 after seven for Evan Reaver for Price's Wood Flooring. Nine for Brian Fournier for Crazy Leaves. He's at 60 after seven. 376 to 319. 57. One of eight. Reva on 36. Not quite, nine drop. Fournier knocks down five. This is for a spare for Reva. Has it. 81 in the ball after eight. For Evan Reva for Price's Wood Flooring. Brian, good try there for the spare, just missed it. A 10 will give him 70 after eight. Missed it, 69 after eight for Brian Fournier. Crazy leaves. 386 to 328. Nardone has three spares in a row coming into the seven. Over on late 35. First for prices. Punches out three. He had 69 to six coming in. Nardone on the fill. Oh, Head pin won't go. There it goes. Make it a seven on the fill. 88 after six for Mike Nardone. Nate gets two there on the second shot. Nardone looking for four in a row. Can he pick it up? He does! He would pull it over. Four in a row for Mike Nardone. 98 in the ball after seven. Sensational bowling. Yeah, tough 94 on that first string. Nate Lee's with an eight on the right side. 77 after seven. 394 to 345. 49. Nate on the head, pin, gets a strike! 87 plus two. The three was the last to fall. A tough three on that spare field for Mike. After getting four in a row, he has some good wood there. Could help him if he hits the pocket properly. Missed it though to the right. Four in a row streak is over. One on one at the seven in the eighth box now. Get 
get seven out of that. 108 after eight. Very good string. Very good string though. 108 for Mike Nardone for Crazy Leads. 404 to 355. Still 49 is the lead for Price Wood Flooring. Won the first by 64. Steve Latch from Salem Mass on 36 on the right. Dennis Green on the left for Crazy Leaves. Latch is working on a spare. Dennis Green is open, 56 after six. On the spare, lemon drop. One fill, 76 after six. Green, nice hit in the head pin. Leaves the five and 10 discount. And off to the left, five standing for the spare. He gets it. 66 in the ball up to seven for Dennis Green for Crazy Leaves. Steve with a six. 82 after seven. Brings Four. the lead down to 46. 411 to 365. Minus this next ball from Dennis Green. Three to two, the mark advantage though for Price's Wood. Latch, eighth box, second string. Four, Green five, to the spare, seven. off, but gets seven. 73 up to seven. Brings the lead below 40. Good try, oh, he pulled the five and ten, seven. Four wouldn't go. Dennis Green misses to the left. Good try by Steve Latch, that's spare. Nine box, 91 after eight. Dennis Green punches out one, eight box, 81 after eight. 420 to 380, 40 pins is the lead for Price's Wood, 104 in the match. Mike Erickson on the left, the green for Crazy Leaves. Mike McGinty on the right, the orange for Price's Wood Flooring. Looking to go to 46 and 20. Crazy Leaves trying to come back and get, make it 31 and 35 for them. McGinty, three on the first ball. Mike working on a spare here. In the seventh box. Off to the right, but gets six, seven. 65 after six for Mike Erickson for Crazy Leaves. McKinty leaves up five after two. Just like that, the lead's down to 33. Crazy Leaves are down, but not out. For a spare, gets it! They needed that one, two in a row. 75 and a ball after seven. Clutch spare by Mike Erickson. And the eight for McGinty. 93 after seven for Mike. 428 to 397. Closing the gap a little bit. 31 flavors out there. But the marks are in favor of Price's Wood. They have a strike and a spare coming up. One spare here for Crazy Leaves for Mike Erickson. He's gotten two in a row. Ginty punches out the half Worcester on 36. On the spare. Off to the right. Left, left rather, gets seven. Left side action. Seven on the fill. 82 after seven. And the lead's down to 24. But two marks on the other side, though, for Price's Wood Flooring gives them the advantage. None for Crazy Leaves, as of yet. Missed it. Needed that one. And a seven box for McGinty. 100 after eight. Erickson gets it this time, always easier on the third shot.
10 box gives him 82, uh, 92, 92 after eight for another, Mike Erickson. Another three pin pick up there. It's down to 21. And now here comes the bowlers. Josh Daly in the right, Chris yeah, Buckets in the left. Yeah, Daly is working on a spare. So they're on three marks actually now. There's a, there's a pin in the channel on 35, they're gonna fix that. So they're actually on three marks, not two, and none for Crazy Leaf. So advantage goes to Price's Wood Flooring. Well, that and the 21 pins, yeah. 85 of the match, so the match is not in range. So Price's Wood Flooring will get at least four minimum. Crazy Lee's trying to battle to get two. Daly on a spare. Gets a strike on spare. Just like that. Parkinson only gets three. He's up to 86 after six and now 96 plus two after seven in the seventh box. That jumped lead up to 38. Chris. Six pin won't go. Looking really good now for Price's Wood Flooring for the sweep. For a 10, nine, 73 after seven for Chris Parkinson for Crazy Leaves. 455 to 423. 32 is the lead in the string, but three marks to work on, including two strikes. Josh on a strike here on 36 on the right. Off the head pin, that's the Caleri, the first of two on the fill. Chris off to the right, clipping the 10 pin. Nice try. Eight in the fill. Chris gets five in that second shot. Daly's up to 104 after seven. Eight box gives him 112 after eight. Parkinson on the out gets nine. He's at 82 after eight. 471 to 432. 39 is the lead. 103 in the match. Yeah, the rest of the team, baby. Two boxes to go for each bowler here in the second and final string of this match. We have three more to go after this, three more matches. A spare and strike coming up here, though. For Crazy Leaves, Evan Reaver on the left is working on a spare. All boxes are open for Crazy Leaves. Brian Fournier only gets three of the first ball. Evan Weaver in the orange on 35, working on a spare. 81 of the ball here in the eighth. He gets the six drop, four horsemen, right? Just like that, the lead is back to 45. 87 after eight for Evan. Brian struggling here in the ninth box. For another spare, missed it, got two. As the 110 pin standing. Nice up by Brian. Nine, 78 after nine. Nine for Evan Riva, 96 after nine. 486 to 441, 45 is the lead. And it's gonna take a miracle for Price's Wood to lose this one. Nice drop by Brian. Can he get the other one to fall? No. Open boxes for both these bowlers in the 10th. Reva head pin for a spin. Nine. Four pin standing. Nice piece of wood. Be one shot if Brian can make this one. Got the field goal instead. For a spare, on it. 106 in the ball. 
for Evan Reba for Prices Wood Flooring. And hit it, but it won't go. Here it goes now. Nine. 87 for Brian Forney. Hit a 108 and an 87. Two string total of 195. For, uh, Scott Douglas in that first spot. Yep. First string. Yep. Combination 195 for the two. Reaver working on a spare one ball to finish up here in 35. At 106 currently. Off to the left gets four. 110 finish. A 18, a 120, and a 110. Two string total of 230 for Evan Reaver. Prices Wood Flooring. And the lead's an even 50. 500 to 450. And, eight, and, Nate leaves, boxes to play. and Nate leaves come up here in a strike. That's going to increase the lead. But first, it's Mike Nardone. Solid string, 108 after eight. He's the bright spot for Crazy Leaves in his string. <laughs> on the strike field, he gets four in the first one. Four standing, can he pick it up? Goes wide left, not two. Second shot, strike fail for a spare. But eight. Nate leads up to 95 after eight. Ten. From Mike Nardone, 118 after nine. Evan, oh, oh, oh. Nate leads the 10 box. File that one 105 away. after nine. That pin was straight in the middle. I, I think there was, there, was a, there was a second piece of wood behind the pin, so the ball bounced extra hard. He got the ball to take out the seven and the, and the wood to fly right. That was a, that was a textbook 710. The you, candle pin with do, the wood. Do like you have that. a study on how many 710, the percentage on a 710? No, I don't have a I don't have a large sample on that. Nate Lee's on 35. Wrapping up quarter. Okay. Mike Dardone, second ball. 10th box, second string. Off to the left. Leaves two, leaves the one and eight pin. Nate Lee's trying to come back in that quarter and gets five there. Nice 10 for Mike Nardone. 128 after a 94 first string. Excellent string for Mike Nardone for Crazy Leaves. Nate Lee's on the out, chops one, gets a five for a 110. He has a 106 and a 110, 216 for the two string total. For Nate Lees. 523 to 470. 53 pin lead. All open boxes now. 117 pin lead in the match. Dennis Green on the right on 36 for Crazy Lees. Gets four. Steve Latch on 35. First ball, ninth box, second string. Three and two. Dennis for a spare bid. Won't go. Steve Latch trying to pull it over. Gets three, Wood wouldn't quite go that far. Dennis settles for nine. 90 after nine. 10, Steve Latch. 101, lead is 54 now. Dennis Green, first ball, 10th box, second string. Off to the right, gets six. That's the one, two, four, and the eight in the back. Side saddle triangle plus the head pin. Steve Latch has the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten pin up. <laughs> Before his first box. <laughs> Too bad there was an 8675309 uh, pin. No zero pins. All right, he gets three on the left. Getting silly here. Dennis gets two of the four. Needs two for 100. Steve Latch, second ball. Four standing. 
Nine for Dennis, 99 for the string. Eight for Latch, 109 string. At 106 and 109, 215 total. 215 for Steve Latch. The Salem, Massachusetts man. Fourth bowlers here, two more bowlers coming up for each side. 541 to 488, is that? Yep. 53 pin lead still. Price with flooring will go to 46 and 20. Crazy Lees will drop to 29 and 37. Mike Erickson on 36. Four horsemen left. Mike McGinty coming in at 92 after eight. Spread Eagle plus one. Mike Erickson has 100 after eight coming in here, the final two. This is for a spare. Gets three. Mike gets two in the left, leaving up five. Going to his third ball. Erickson going for a 10. Give him 110 if he makes it, which he does. 110 after nine. And eight for Mike McGinty. 108 after nine. 549 to 498. 51 pin lead. Three boxes to go. Wrapping up our second match, we have three more to go after this. 35 freezes up again. Erickson's now at 102. Okay. At that 10 box? No, that's a 107, sorry, 107. It's a 90s, yeah. 102, 102 it says here. Oh uh, no, that's actually a seven. All right, 107 then, okay. That's a 90. Oh yeah, okay, yeah. It's hard to see. It looks like a two from here. It's we're 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 way far back. It does look like a one two on the screen though. Yeah, it is. A, it's a, it's a, those are, it's a 92 next to it and a 102. It's a 102. Sorry. Okay. Guys. I, I do have uh, prescription glasses. Sometimes it doesn't help though. Only for distance and reading. You actually see it pretty well on the screen. Yeah. <laughs> Only for reading, I need the glasses. Regular sight's no problem. I hate wearing them, but I have to wear them. 35 is a delay here, uh, causing havoc on the sweep. Paul Grant, Bob Lee with you here from the U.S. Invitational in Lita Lanes, National New Hampshire. Three more matches to come. Matches tomorrow morning, Saturday morning, 9 a.m. Street Live. Next match we see here is going to be New England flooring against Team USA. After about a four and a half minute break. Just enough time to hit the bathroom and uh, get the lineups. <laughs> No breaks, not stop action. Only a few matches remaining on our left. Yep. Lanes are clear. Okay, here we go. Tenth box. Mike Erickson on the right on 36. Good head pin, good head pin hit, but leaves the six pin standing on the right. Two, four, seven on the left. Here's Mike McGinty. Strike! Hey. 118 plus two in the 10th box for Mike McGinty for Newmark, New Hampshire. Again, trying, to beat the dummies. trying to beat his 121 average. <laughs> they would have swept them 6-0. The dummies are a tough out. They came in third place last year and they're above 500 this year. The dummies are gonna protest. They want, they want, they want the prize money. <laughs> Eight box for Mike Erickson. One ten string. Ninety six. We have the first string. One foot. One of the first. 
to 11 total. I right, look at a double strike. It's eight in the first ball to wrap up here. One more, two more balls to go. Nine in the fill, 127. Mike McGinty, 119 and 127, 246 for the two strings. Commanding lead for Price's Wood Flooring, 568 to 506. They won the first by 64. Six pin sweep, 46 and 20 now. Crazy leads will drop to 29 and 37. Price's Wood looking for a buy in the first round of the playoffs starting tomorrow. With the finals on Saturday here at the U.S. Invitational in Nashua at Lita Lanes. Anchor balls to wrap it up here. Chris Parkinson on the right, coming with 82 after eight. Daly with a spare. Josh with a 122 and a ball after nine. 10 for Parkinson, 92 after nine. Second match to wrap up, three more to go. The World Series of Bowling here, and there it is. Strike for Chris Parkinson. Trying to go out to high note for Crazy Leaves, 102 plus two. Josh with a five in the spare, 127 after nine. Looking for another one. Missed it. His teammates razz him in good fun. He's up to 134 right now. Best he can do is 137. It's rough being a teammate sometimes, huh, Bob? <laughs> he gets the 10 for a 137 finish. Chris on the strike gets three in his first ball. 126 and 137. What was our top score today? Uh, that's it right there, 137. That was it. That was for us. Score. Chris gets a six on the strike, Phil, for a 108 finish. He has a 110, the 108, 218 total. Congratulations to Pricewood Flooring. 6-0 sweep, 593 to 5. It's a 5. 532. Dominated both games, one by 64, and that one by 61. Yep. Congratulations to Prices, and uh, we'll take a break now and see you soon on the lanes.